in this video i'm going to show you how to fix fortnite not launching on pc because of anti-cheat error so please watch the video until the end and follow this tutorial step by step to avoid making mistakes so the first thing we want to do is to completely shut down our epic games launcher so we want to close this we want to click on exit and make sure that it's not on our task manager so we want to right click on our taskbar and select task manager and search for epic games so we want to make sure that epic games is not open so from here we want to search for our fortnite folder we want to select epic games fortnite then fortnite game then binaries then win 64 so from here we want to select the easy anti-cheat folder so from here we want to launch this easy anti-cheat application and we can see here we want to select the game and just click on uninstall so it said uninstall successfully so we want to click x and we want to go back to another folder and from here we just want to select these two anti-cheat folders and delete don't worry when we delete this we can just recover it back so now we want to go back to binaries and win64 now we want to scroll down and find all of this fortnite client application make sure that all of this are on exe files so we want to select this five uh, applications and go delete so after we have deleted that we want to open our epic games launcher after we have opened our epic games launcher we want to go to our library and as you can see here our fortnite says repair so here we want to click on the three dots and tap on manage from here we want to click on verify files so that's it uh, epic games will now repair and verify our fortnite files and replace it with a new and correct ones so after you have verified uh, your game it will look like this uh, take note that uh, this verification will not last uh, for a long time it will just take up to one to two minutes so just be patient with it so as you can see your fortnite game now says here launch it means that epic games has already replaced and added a new anti-cheat and fixed all your problems if you find this video helpful please hit like and subscribe thanks